Hello, uh, it's been a while, uh, but anyway, today we're going to build uh, my reward system. Um, essentially, you drop items in and you can get items in return. So, for example, throw this in, click this, gives you the bloody lapis lazuli block or I don't know how you pronounce that. Um, it also has a return feature where if you press this switch it'll give you your items back. You just drop down here, collect them and that's it. Um, so okay we'll build it here. Right so first thing we're going to do is the mono stable switch. So you want to Build like that, repeater on three ticks. Tor torch on there, redstone dust there, redstone dust, redstone dust. Okay? As you can see over there. Now you want to do the power line. Now this goes along, this powers the basic the counter system. The system, well, this, not the counter system, but the system it counts. So, place redstone dust all the way along. Pistons extend, remove that, that's that bit done. So place stuff like this. Sand, 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 and then you just want to place another block in between here. Uh, I'm just placing a uh, wheel. So you want to put a torch on here, a repeater on two ticks, a repeater on two ticks, a repeater on two ticks. And that's that bit done. So next part, as da, da, da. as we'll do the pistons above. So what you do is place pistons here, like so. You might place sand on top, move these blocks, and then you might place blocks like so. And you might place blocks like so. Um, sorry I've not really can uploaded anything, um, just been kind of a bit lazy, but hopefully this makes up for it. Anyway, so you want to build like so, you want to paste red redstone dust along like so, and you want to place your dispensers like so. And then you want to place redstone torch, redstone torch, torch, uh, no torch, repeater, 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 repeater. Now that's that part done. Um, so basically that will now function when the piston extends and stuff. So that's the dispensing part done. Now we want to build, I uh, don't need these anymore, so we'll use grey wheel. So now you want to build a kind of standing area right so you want to build your door god what was that was it four wasn't it yeah I've not actually rehearsed this so I'm kind of doing it on the fly I've just not basically finished this so as that's that one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So bear with me. Right, so move that one and place that there. Right. God. Right, so if I build across like that, we'll put a switch here later. Remove this block. Now you want to get yourself a fence and a pressure plate. And you want to place the fence there, pressure plate there. Then you want to get yourself a redstone lamp. Or you can use glowstone. Um, 
Well, actually, you can't use glowstone because the redstone lamp lets the signal go down. And if you place a solid block next to a pressure plate on a stat on a fence post, it's some it doesn't work. It's as if there's like the hip box changes and the blocks just float on top. So you have to use glowstone or this block. Uh, we'll use green. And then what you want to do is build down. Build down and build down. Get yourself some redstone dust and plonk it on. And that's basically that bit done. So when you throw it on, bus one goes. Uh, I need a button. So let's plonk a button. 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 Hit that. That activates. Hit these. These don't do anything. Right, so that's that bit done. So let's set up the reset line. So use yellow wheel and we will go like so. All the way along. Across. Down one, down one, down. All the way along here. And then you want to go and you want to delete these and you'll see in a second why. Bring the redstone dust down and go all the way along into that block. That will disable the whole line and it will reset everything. Now, whilst we're here, we can plonk these on. Um, these are light indicators. So you know when stuff's activated. So it should look like that. And then you want to put repeaters here, here, and here. Dust, dust, dust. And then you want to stick like so. As you can see, because one's activated, it's, it's, it's enabled. Um, and you need to do that because I've done this wrong. So, redstone dust all the way along. Repeat a four ticks, repeat a four ticks. Now you need a sticky piston. You might plonk the sticky piston here. And you can put any block you want, just stick. Actually, you know what, we'll change it to a lovely purple. So, this is basically, this is the system that when you activate, when you get, receive your item, it, it destroys your currency. So, um, and we'll plonk another one. Another one goes not there. Bugger. Oh, come on. Right, so you place another one here. And this is your, re your return. This will return your currency. So, give me my blue wheel. So, what you do is you run your blue wheel down here. Like so. Like so. And you want to put a repeater on four ticks. Dust, 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 dust. And we plonk a button here. So this is your reset. This resets everything. So this will give you a currency back as well. Now, we're basically done. We've just got to plonk in the return, the wall for the return system. Basically, the a ladder going down in a wee bit, and we need glass, lava. You don't need glass. You can use any use stone or, or something. I'm just using glass as an example because then you can see what I'm doing. And you want da -da -da, ladders and a trapdoor. So what you want to do is where are we here? All right. So we're going to have lava down here. All right, so you want to kind of encase this so it doesn't like, burn anything. I actually don't need that one there. And that one. All right, so we'll... Oh, there we go. Make sure you, you seal it. Because um, last time it burnt that red that 
wheel there and kind of start wrecking it. So, like so, remove this block, bring it along, and then you can let's let me change that for a solid. Um, let's make that blue. Right, what you want to do is place ladders like so, a trapdoor like so, and now we'll fill in the back here. Uh, I put a redstone torch here, a uh, lamp sorry, um, because it lights up when you throw stuff in, so it's like an, an indicator that it's actually worked, as you'll see, so we'll use dirt as a currency. So when you throw it in, lights up, one activates, lights up, two activates, lights up, gets stuck, you know, for crying out loud. Beat it, there we go, lights up, and then you would walk along here and you would push the switch, you get your item and it resets it, and then it destroys your currency. This piston shoves it into the lava and that's kind of base of that. Um, do this. Now, if I were to get them back, all I do is hit this button. Walk down here, and they're there. Simple. So, hopefully that was kind of straightforward. <laughs> um, it's been a few weeks since I've actually kind of done a tutorial or anything. Um, I just finished that. Um, it was somebody on YouTube just done it. Um, can't remember his name. Um, he's not done a tutorial for it, but it was kind of his concept. He made it, so this is my version. I think mine's is slightly smaller than smaller than his. Was this is as small as I can get it? Try and find his name. You know, credit him for the idea. Um, Uh, FedEx Gaming. Um, so check his channel out. He does redstone stuff. He's quite good at it. So, anyway, hopefully. Aha, see? See? Bloody thing. Fill that wee gap up there. And you end up, it destroys. This is what I was saying. So use like stone or something. Damn lava. Right, or just place glass blocks here and it doesn't destroy it anymore so anyway that's it so thanks for watching thanks for listening to ramble on and hopefully if you want to i'll not finish it if you want to extend it um all you do is just add these just keep going along um and if you need to extend this line just plonk a repeater in between these so that the signal will carry on um same down here on the white blocks if you stick a repeater there it'll just carry it'll repeat the signal another 15 blocks so you, this can go for pfft, as long as you want I guess um, you just have to extend stuff so but so anyway just you know essentially just build a shape plonk it along a block and that's it Anyway, I'll stop rambling on. Uh, well, happy, happy building it, and hopefully you get some use out of it. So, thanks for watching, and bye-bye.